In today's video, I'm going to show you one of the best ways to attack cover two defense in Madden consistently year over year. And this play comes to us out of the Gun Bunch formation in the West Coast playbook. If you guys want to get my entire West Coast offensive ebook, I'm going to put a link to that in the Patreon. You can get that for just 10 bucks and it will make you a better Madden player. Now we're going to be taking a look here at the play corner strike. And what you're going to notice with this is when I check into a cover two kind of coverage, we have this really deep corner route to the right side. All we need to do to beat cover two is we're just going to put a streak to our slot wide receiver. What this is going to do is it is going to drive the deep half defender back. And you're going to see here that essentially we're going to really attack the cover two vertically down the field. And that corner route is going to get up and over the top of the defender. Now, what's best when running this play is utilizing your bunch formation to the wide side of the field. This is going to give your route a significantly more significant more amount of depth that it can get to so that it can attack cover two over the top. And if you rat catch this, you have a potential for a one play score. Now, another little piece of this that I did want to quickly mention to you is sometimes what people will do is they will put their cornerbacks in outside thirds to create essentially a cover three or Tampa three uh, style of look. So I'm going to show you that real quick here. We're going to go safety nickelback package and we're going to go back to that corner strike concept. Now, the biggest key here is understanding how the zones work in Madden. So basically what you're going to get typically is you're going to get these safeties in outside thirds so that they can get out there on that corner route. This will open up the seam area of the field. So what you're going to see right here is a streak right off rip is going to get wide open up the middle of the field as well against this specific type of coverage shell. The beauty of this is now what they're going to have to start doing is they're going to have to start putting their middle linebacker into the deep middle of the field which is going to make this a little bit more difficult uh, just in terms of who they can use or and uh, what all is going to be available to you offensively. Now, when they do that, when they do put that middle linebacker in the middle of the field like that, what I like to do on the back side of this concept is we could just put a basic little check down in route and block our running back to be able to pick up any kind of blitz. And you'll see that this check down becomes wide open in the middle of the field because they have to respect the fact that you could send somebody right up the seam area uh, to attack the coverage shell. Another little thing real quick here about this is this streak route does have potential to get over the top of uh, cover two coverage. You'll see here, I'm just going to free form or pass lead it up and inside. And with the way possession catches and rat catches work in this game, it's a tight window, but there is a little bit of a window there that you can hit uh, against this cover two coverage. So again, I'll show it to you and you'll see here, just going to throw it to the inside possession, catch that. And you're going to, they're typically going to tackle you, but a lot of times you'll be able to catch that in, in, in traffic. The beauty of this play is it does also beat a variety of different other coverages, but this play is best ran when they're running cover two. And specifically, I like to use this play with my bunch to the wide side of the field. So that's the best way, in my opinion, to attack cover two zone, where the, the area of cover two that is vulnerable is the seam area of the field and the deep sideline area of the field. The other thing we didn't even talk about too much yet is this uh, C route on the left side. So the C route on the left side this year is actually pretty good with free form because you can free form it over the cloud flat defender and you can free form it up into the corner where that deep half defender really can't defend it. So they're gonna have to make a lot of adjustments to their cover two because we're kind of hitting them in the whole shot areas of the cover two coverage. And with free form, you're able just to put the ball in pretty good positions this year. If you guys want to get the rest of the Gun Bunch offensive ebook, uh, my West Coast offense is available by joining the Patreon. It's only 10 bucks to become a member. Make sure to go down in the description and go check out the Patreon down below.